All right, we're back. It's been a couple of days. I did not know that if you get 100 bond into characters from your masters that you get their alternate cost in. But hey, get camis now. Let's see. I also read that to get the, a Chinese um, dress, it's like a rare drop from someone in Chinatown. It's just rare. So we're going to take a look at this, and I might probably switch the knight and see if I can hunt knight down. You're just going to check a shit ton of people. It's Kung Fu Top. If I don't have that, let's get that. Nine seconds to last. She should die in one hit. That's, that's kind of it looks like a, more like a dress. What did she got? Is it backwards cap? First attack. Have I got this? You knew I was going to go down mid. You knew I was. There's some butt here. Let's talk. Sublin, welcome to the Hong Kong, uh, Hong whatever they have chinatown i mean, i can interest you in some dim sum we've got some ramen too because one thing that people associate with china food is the food we get orders from all over the city and nowadays we've even got drones to do the delivering for us what a convenient world we live in huh i've probably read that 15 times didn't even know about it so that chinese dress right there should be like a rare drop. How annoying is this to get? Assuming that's not from the enemies. You are well, shit. Don't be using my EX on stupid shit. This guy's got gold. Bow, bow, bro. I'm gonna take them Jamie points. Come on, sweet pea. Nope. Is this gonna drive me nuts? I want a Chinese dress. I'm a Chinese master. As soon as you step out, the music changed for one thing. Thought Hawk sock Quinchy uh, outfit, no. I'm not interested. So if we went over here and went nighttime.
Mm -mm. Drinking coffee. Traditional Chinese cap. Mario. Oh. Isn't this awesome? Nothing so far. What you got? What do you got? It's a tube top. Defeat driver. Use driver to attack two times. Can I just buy this? Come on, jump up and do that again. Fuck! You got you did was chunk. You just summoned Chung Lee. She's gonna whoop her ass. Gawking. Yeah, it's freaking done. That's probably because I got the damn buttons all configuration all stupid. Hey there, chum. What do you say to make some mancho moolah together? Where did this town host a huge tournament? Blah, 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 blah. I thought that might have been him. What's the key item he has? Flight ticket. I don't give a shit about that. There's not too many people fighting down the alley part of it. If I step out, music's gonna change. I'm gonna get my dollar here. Step back in. Is that, does that drop the enemy? So they, they've jumped down from the ceiling again. Yeah, it, reached, it changed the spawn. What do you got? It's a vest. I think I'm already wearing a vest, dude. So that guy's still in the same spot. Some of them are always, well, maybe not always, but they're, they're going to be there to have words to say. And then some of them are like um, just randos. So I'm wondering if it's a rando or if it's going to be a set person like that. That guy's equipment's changing every time I walk by. Okay. But he's still there. What do you got? Vest.
tube top. Use tribe impact absorb. Same fucking thing. Two tap. Same fucking thing. I'm about to get I'm about to get annoyed by this shit. Tube top. Same fucking the same exact same thing. Drive impact to absorb two hits. This kind of shit drives you nuts, man. We're about to get, we're about to uh, forsake it and go back to the damn trying to do the main mission. You might need in order to hit this. You might need to grind up and um, have some of the, what was it more drops from the enemies thing in order to hit that at a regular level. Anyway, fuck that. But that's I bet you. I bet you that's how you do it. Um, what are we doing now? What does it mean? What is strength? I'm gonna try to go through and talk to the main characters before I. I bet you I can look this up, but um, I'm kind of curious about joining my own. So. Where's Thrasher at? He is down this hall, down this area. Eliza will be over here. Yep. Talk. See, like our story's pretty much wrapped up. Now it's time for your story. And if you're looking for a fight, hey, I'm always ready to bounce. Okay. It's gonna look like. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Let's talk to Frasher. Fuck his little guys here. <laughs> What's good, Chong Lee? Decided you'll want to team up with me and clutch this city in the palm of your hand after all? Eh, who am I kidding? At this point, I can't see it. You ought to keep on walking your own path just the way you want to. You go your way and I'll go mine. Ha 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 ha. Another thing I could try, try will be. Um, I'm gonna try the resistance members in Nashau. After that, I'm already running into the main characters, unless you're gonna be able to talk to Tracy and uh, I forgot the other, the other two characters. The ones in the tutorial characters. Let's talk to Kamalia yeah, here. There's a little need to discuss the gritty details. You saw it for yourself up close and personal. Allow me to leave you with these parting words. Botch is strong, but of course, you probably know that better than anyone. Yeah, I already talked to you. JP seeks to draw innocence into his web of lives. We must devise a method to defuse his madness. And so you won't let me go up here. Hey. Wu's brother Dosh is unbelievably earnest, truly a straight shooter. He always go on about how he wanted to get strong and help the country. Yeah, I don't know about that, bro. So is this daytime? It's daytime. So you better space map. Check this shit out. You've beaten all of the mains. There's like a, a minor quest you haven't done. And then there's like a story quest.
Huh. Where is that Ua girl at? I want to show you she was just down the street somewhere. I used to see her around here. How many other characters are there to really talk to? So you you start off, you talk with Luke. You can ask Luke. We can ask Luke. Okay, we'll ask Luke. That is I mean, that makes the most sense. So there's Luke. Who else do you talk to? Um. You might have already talked to him. Plenty of folks practice martial arts, soldiers, yoga masters, even musicians. Status or profession, it doesn't matter. Their goals may be different. I mean, may differ, but they're uh, all fighters on their own right. The way I see it. To be a fighter is the way of life and attitude. I knew he wasn't gonna do nothing like that. I knew you weren't gonna say anything, bro. Because you're down, you're you're like you're like super master mode. Fuck it. What are we doing here? What do I gotta do here to finish this off? So, um, How to finish it off. So it's the influencer. He is in, um, he's near. So he's probably near the damn, um, that's actually anticlimactic as fuck. I mean, you've beat the story. You thought there was like some, maybe not. There he is right there, influencer. Yo. Hey, whoa, it's been a minute, I think. Psh, like time is real anyway, am I right? Seriously, though, I'm pretty sure it's been a while. Still on your journey, huh? Mm -hmm. Managed to find the strength you were searching for? I sure did. I found it, I guess. I don't know. No kidding. Sure, there aren't many encounters still waiting for you in Nutshell or whatever. I've done them. Can you really say for sure that you found it? Yeah, I found it. That's it's right. No, but I mean... Yeah, sure. Hey, suit yourself, dog. That look on your face says you've done everything there is to do. In that case, I've got uh, just a place for you. Ever hear of the Battle Hub? It's a place where fierce fighters from across the globe gather. You can get there from the world map, too. So feel free to check it out if you're feeling punchy. It's a wild world out there. You'll see. Okay, and what about equivalent exchange? Just finish it up and we'll have every we'll have every main and little side quest done. Yeah, people as soon as I turn it to top it in. It's about tons of people who are on sites about it.
An equivalent exchange is an early side quest given to the player's custom character by their counterfeit. I didn't get it till late. After completing the main story mission, search for the back. We'll teach players how to NPC items up. Tracking them down can be tricky, okay? So I need cards, pipes, and rings. You get them from the NPCs. Cards can be found around Beat Square. Pipes, Chinatown. So these are just rando. You just take them from randos. Caramels. First attack. Eight punches. Eight punches. Unique attacks. Aerial attacks. Oh, dear God. Car defeat using Kami style. Fuck you. All right, so I have the cards. China down for pipes. You still went the wrong way. Uh, I'm, not looking for trouble. Uh, I'm not looking for trouble. So it's gonna be a triangle. Look for triangle items and their and their information. All these dives and shit. Your butters, your butt heads aren't offering many items and shit, you jerks. Pipe is considered a um, throw for three times. So get a pipe from him. So it, it's considered a. Uh, you're not gonna be able to throw him three times because you're gonna kill his ass. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. You have to spec your character down somehow. Pipe. Hit with three aerial attacks. Okay. Three jumping light punches is what it's going to do. Fuck you, bitch. Quit it. And step on your head four times. Oh, this. She's going to be a hoe. That's one pipe, so I need another one. And so that the pipe item looks like a um, looks like a gold bar reward or whatever. Okay, so just check each one. You got one. Knock down three times. She's gonna die. She ain't gonna take three hits. Uh oh, she got it. Okay, so got them. 
All right, so now I need rings and just look at the guide here. Rings can be found outside Bay Park area. I don't sure what the f Bay Park area. I think I've, yeah, I've had a ring. Ring, defeat an opponent with an active buff. What kind of buff are you talking about? Uh, can you do that with what you got? Just, go, just find someone else who'd be annoying as hell trying to figure that out. Details. Hit with three aerial attacks. Good. Three more stomps to the head. Report back to counterfeit Leonardo. Not a problem. Cheap music. What the fuck that was? Can't believe I didn't see that there. How'd you? They, they put it in there. Talk. You don't say. Leonardo. Oh, hey, you got everything? Nice, nice. Yep, that's all of it. Here, you can have this. Just a little way of saying thanks. Until next time, eh? An officer's cap. You get an M. Bison hat. Reach rank 14 or greater in Jamie's style. That is literally Jamie's mission. So we only... We, there are still things left. There'll be the two master missions you get from each master as you level them up. I'm, I'm not going to do those. Um, but... I've got one more curiosity to try to do on this playthrough. Um, all right, let's take a look at my items here, and we're going to derive whatever the hell uh, Chung Lee wants. Okay, so the old, I have a hundred thousand dollars to do this with too. The ultra items are like the, um, the the goodies where you'll get pretty good stats from them for your characters. Now I have to figure out what Chun Li wants. Okay, so we're just gonna um, so Kiri is Dalzine, and there should be in theory eighteen of these, right? Soba is Ryu. Right, this I'm writing this shit down. Um. There was something for E Honda. You know, you know E Honda's as well. But if you look at this, what do we have here? We have canned herring, jellied eel, celery chips, a curiously divisive taste. Answer lies within the heart of love. I think I've given her that. And unique player cards are J D J P. And then jury is the wrench or whatever. All right. And the bear, wooden bear is a uh, Zangri. The lukewarm beer is um, is DJ. All right. So I've got a good start to go with. So we're going to go and we're going to chunk each one of these damn items, and we'll see if she, what I have in my inventory might be good enough. She might like that. She has a super item, but I need to. There's no telling which one gives you the super item for, you know? So we're just gonna gift them some bitches. 
gift. Opening these is always a thrill. So, what we have here, they're not telling what's ultimate above it. So, what we need to do is say Jelly Deals and Ultimate Ultra. I'm sorry. Okay, so giving that her to her first. Thank you. Well, thank you. I'm sure you're putting a lot of time into choosing this. That's very thoughtful of you. It's not Jelly Deal. Okay, so look at your items. The weird thing is, I'll just look up the final mission, but somehow we just want to, you know, we want to derive what Chung Lee gives. Listen, man, I can't, I can't explain this. I can't explain this logic. I can't, I can't, because I'm a stalker. A stalker. Okay, so what about um, celery chips? Let's try that. I'm so happy. <laughs> By the way. No, I'm not going to fight you right now. I've already beat you. Gift. So we're going to sell her chips. Thank you. Why, thank you. It's not that. So we got canned eel. I mean, um, is it, no, is it canned uh, herring? That's nasty as hell. I'm thinking I'm getting key items for uh, main missions that I don't, I don't even know is supposed to be there. I mean, for not main, but mastery missions. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, so let's go with canned herring. Because I have three of these. If it's, it's just, That's nasty as fuck, Chung Lee, if this is what you like. What the hell's your problem? Is this what I think it is? Oh, it reeks of high, to high heaven. Erg. Why do you want that? That is it. Chung Lee. That's freaking nasty. Wait, wait. You take pleasure in watching me suffer, don't you? Well, I've had enough. She's a masochist. She's a fucking masochist. Wait, wait. You take pleasure in watching me suffer. I've had enough. Good God, Chung Lee. That's what you want. That's so disgusting. Huh? Oh, you want to know about my family? Where, where to start? I live with Lei Fang at the moment. She's my student, but she's... Like a younger sister to me and a friend. Though frankly, she's young enough to be my daughter. To be honest. When I first met her, she got caught up in the schemes of an evil, evil organization. Of course. The fallout of that incident led me to taking her in. While I was able to save her from the situation she was in, it traumatized her a lot. Nobody could get through to her. Now she didn't have any family left, so I decided to bring her into my own. It was a little awkward for both of us in the beginning, mind you. Uh-huh. She's got a knack for programming and analysis. At first, those were the only things she showed any interest in. Nice but I had her practice martial arts with me, and she started to open up. She's got a lot stronger physically and mentally, too. <laughs> Before I knew it, she'd grown into a sassy little girl. Yeah. She's found her own kind of strength now. At this point, I'm sure she could handle herself without me. While it's nice to be able to say that, it's also a touch bittersweet. Aside from Lin Fin, he's gone now, but I always looked up to my father. He was a police officer in Hong Kong and violently fought against the criminal underworld. Just so you know. He also instructed me in the ways of martial arts. By the way. My father is the originator of the revolving crane kick, better known as the spinning bird kick. Okay. Spinning bird kick, huh? He passed it to me, and now I'll pass it to you and Lin Fang. A technique passed from one generation to the next. And in that time, the day may arrive when you pass it on to someone else. No, I keep it. It's only my move. You're not your move no more, bitch. Alright, so what we have to do now is we have to go get canned herring, whatever the fuck that is. So what we're, the best way to do is to go to DJ first, because I remember DJ had a shit ton of those items. I have a new message, I'm assuming from Chung Lee. Oh, ordinary girl. You know, I've always wanted to be an ordinary girl. That said, wait a sec. You just rolled your eyes. 
even through text, I could tell. Is that some kind of secret mystical kung fu ability? You could say that. The Kiko tells me everything. Kikoken? But joking aside, I do often wonder what ordinary even means. Everyone lives their life their own way. In times of peace and strife alike, maybe ordinary is all in the eye beholder. No need to fret, though. I'm quite content with life just the way I am. I won't let the pain of the past or present drag me down. I strive to always um, stay positive always. And I consider myself blessed to have my students. Why the hell? They gave me a mission right here? Talk? Hey. Listen, the sea breeze is speaking to us. When you seek lies in the city shrouded in st steam, move like a wave gliding across the shore. What the fuck was he talking about? DJ must have gave me a mission. Ah, yes. Listen to the whisper of the waves. When you seek at the foot of which houses the light that guides you, let the wind lead you where... Yeah, just... just you're talking about get high, dude. I ain't got time for it. Okay, so... It's not actually the DJ. You're talking to the merchant. What can I get for you? Just sell me the fucking herring, dude. Elevator 8 is uh, Luke. I'm pretty sure that Bajorois is Manon. I'm almost positive. That's a wine. Which means the Baba Bro sticker is might be somebody else. But the problem is he does not have. Take care. He does not have the can herring. I don't know exactly what the fuck that is. I've seen it. It was given to him as a reward several times, so we'll try we'll just go down the list, dude. Go to Coliseum and just fucking go and find the damn can herring, buy it, and take it to Chun Lee. Rubber duck is his Yee Honda. That is what, what is that? Um, End of the level here. King Street. I don't know what Cammy likes. What can I get for you? So the England guy ain't even selling anything. What's Blanky got to say? I think you've got what it takes to use this move. I can tell you've got a lot of serious wild streak in you. Vertical roll. Backstep roll. I'm feeling serious wild streak myself. So tell me what if you can. Spar with the master. Mike, I'm on a mission here. I ain't got time for your stupidness. He's level 22. Input read my fucking throat. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. 
Hey, what a little asshole. Fuck you, asshole. Look at that damage, bitch. You suck. Fuck you. Fuck, I love fucking that up like an idiot. Fuck you, little shit. Not bad at all. Stay wild. Got seven up for that. And more interactions. I'm walking away from you because I don't like you, Belinka. How about that? I think you're an asshole. What can I get for you? General store. There's a lukewarm beer. The wood folk carving. Bet you that wood folk is what I'm pretty sure. That's for, um... Take care. Or was that... Is that might not be... That might be a usable item. As opposed to a treasure. Gimbu Temple. Watch none of them fucking happen. I could just go out there some weird-ass place to get can canned herring. What can I get for you? Nato. It's one of the items. I don't know who likes that. Take care. I'll get the. <laughs> I have to go get on the aircraft carrier to get the canned herring, man. So that's where it's gonna be, right? It makes perfect sense. What can I get for you? He's not selling shit. Take care. Thunderfoot settlement. Who's going down the list, man? Down the list. You figure one of these people will be selling the canned herring. I want to look it up, probably. What can I get for you? A cookbook. Doing your best. Oh, this is my own. Doing your best to see. Let me give you this as a reward. With you where you're at now, it should be perfect fit. We're on point. That's that kick thing. It's like sort of an anti-air, but not really. It's a good combo finisher. I bet you. What can I get for you? Took cold tomato soup. 
That's another gift item. I ain't got enough freaking space for all this shit. Him. What can I get for you? What can I get for you? The bear, he's just the bear's right here. You can just buy the bear for Zangrieve. So is it at the Dowsing Temple? It's not the Dowsing Temple. We have to go shopping. We're going to go out throughout the world and find it. But I'm really just gonna Google that shit up. Can Herring, where the Bob? What can I get for you? The wrench is at the here. It's not fucking here. Of course not. We try to do this smartly, we're just gonna just. Shopkeeper door, no shell. Everyone run away. Teleport again. All right. So we should have to buy five of these. Get six just in case. That's only $30,000. Raised by savages, raps and the rats today, or some shit. I don't think. Well, boom, boom. Oh, I got run over. Never mind. I'm good. Gift. A gift? Can't hear you. I have six of them. You take pleasure in watching me suffer, don't you? Well, I've had enough. How much are you? 81. Can Herring? Had enough. 86. Had enough. 91. New interactions. The time I've spent teaching you has been quite profound to me. It's helped me remind me of my past self training with single minded determination. To encounter another is a curious thing. I can only express thanks to the world as it continues to return. Yeah. You've improved as a martial artist as well. You're far more formidable than when we first met. So, what comes next for you? Did you find an answer in your pursuit of strength? Oh, yes. Perhaps you can assist me with my kung fu class, assuming you don't mind, of course. <laughs> hey, I'm thinking about it. I really started to enjoy this. Right, Let's continue fighting for the future. Forever and always. You receive Chung Lee welcome emote as reward for increasing your bond. Uh huh. A gift. Can Herring? 
96. One more. Take pleasure. Blah, blah, blah. Four up. And new interactions available. Obtain outfit two. Lei Feng wants to go shopping sometime. Interested in tagging along? She suggested I invite you. She usually just shops online, but it, she said it would be more fun to go out uh, about together. What is she like, you ask? Um, Outside of programming, she seems quite fond of pandas and chocolate. I bought her a bag with a panda design and she was little and I'm pretty sure she uses it to this day. However, when she's happy, I can't help but smile. And well, I can't help but buy her what she wants either. I assume she's been begging you for things too. Just try not to overindulge her, okay? <laughs> Which is rich coming from me, I know. Right. I love shopping myself. Snacking on something sweet along the way is one of life's little pleasures, so we'll be sure to grab something nice. Some canned herring? Is that what you've been on? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, I can taste it already. All right, then. Anyway, feel free to tag along sometime to get the shopping picture. Okay. Chung Lee's not unlocked the pose in photo mode. Enjoy your unique poses. Okay, so one more I want. Which is new message I'm assuming from Chung Lee. Yeah. Just chit chat. Can I talk to you about something? This drama series on TV had me in tears. What was it about? It's about a man overcoming danger in order to save his sick girlfriend. Hmm. You know, when I typed it out like this, it really does sound generic. But in all sincerity, I really enjoyed it. Wow, look at us. Just chatting about nothing in particular. It feels like we've known each other forever. Anyway, talk to you later. Okay. Now. Gal. We're just gonna fucking Google this shit up. The best master gifts for each character. Blanka wants to knock off Blanka Chan. I knew that. Cammy wants a jelly deal. That's that stupid British shit, man. You, If you have the haggler fucking skill, you can make this cheap. Canned herring. That makes no damn sense. Chung Lee. Um, Gal wants Nado. Why? Because it has a coffee taste? Ken wants the cookbook. Jury wants the wrench. Kimberly wants the um, the movie. Lily wants celery chips. Marissa wants cold tomato soup. And, and so I know all of them. Alright, so Gal wants natto, and I know where that is. So we're going to go to map. Fast travel. world map and you get that from Japan so I'm assuming gal's ultimate super goodie would be a uh, the canned coffee or whatever I'm, I'm done doing that we're gonna get our characters and we're gonna, we're gonna call it a day I gotta move on uh, let's see what can I get for you general store buy Wait, before you realize, I need, well, before I start buying, how much do I have to get it for him? He's a 71, so, um, six will do it. That's gonna put me broke. What can I get for you? Raised by the savages. 
rats and bandages. Alright, we're gonna gift him the, the Nato. You know, you remind me of another martial artist. The next time we fight, I'll have a feeling you'll be at their level. The gift is appreciated too, thanks. This reminds him of Ryu and he likes it. What is it? Nato. Oh. What's this? Is you me a challenge, are you? Uh. Fine by me. I'll repay the favor the next time we spar. What is it? Nato. Oh. What's this? Uh. It's, okay. Blah blah blah. Eighty six. What is it? Oh. Uh. Oh. Uh. Ninety one. What is it? Oh, uh. 96. What is it? Oh. Oh, uh. New interactions available. Okay, so. Talk. Oh. You definitely improved. There aren't many active soldiers out there with your grasp of technique. That's bound to come from in handy for you down the road. Anyway, when I first met you, I was torn. Should I embrace the change as a soldier or resist it? Well, today I have my answer. I poured my heart and soul into hand-to-hand -hand combat. I'm passing that passion to you. The fight's not going to be an easy one. It's a bloodbath in there and hot as hell to boot. A far cry from the battles I'm going to be, um, or I'm going to be overseeing. I thought you said overseas. I'm like, okay. I'm like, where are you going now? I'll be commanding unmanned weapons, but these soldiers involved still bleed. They need protecting all the same. Adapt to any situation. Never fear change. That's what it means to be a pro. Okay. Obtain Gal Bullseye. Hmm. Charlie died not once, but twice. The first time, he had Bison dead to rights. Then his backup betrayed him, plunging him into the waterfall. They never found his body. He went MIA. But was officially recognized as killed in action. But... But a certain organization brought him back from the brink of death. The details remain shrouded in mystery. Well, you can play the Street Fighter Five story, and it would be freaking just all around bad. But you know, you can play it. Some little bug thought he could be on my overpriced monitor. His existence is no more. I gotta get the guts off the fucking screen. The blood, blood guts on my OLED. I was able to see him once more, however, briefly, and this time. He had the ability to neutralize psycho power. He used every ounce of his strength to chase down Bison again, and this time he entrusted Ryu to put him away for good. That's right. When Charlie died a second time, I was there to watch him go. Ryu and Chung Lee saw him off too. He proved his bravery, staying true to his ideals of righteousness to the very end. Uh. And when I visit his grave, sometimes my friends are there to see him too. He's forever by our side. So you got Chung Lee, Ryu, and Gal giving putting the Charlie's da dog tags. Okay. Got it. Now then. No, I don't. I'm good. Okay. So he's a hundred. So if we go to um, where did that escape? Main menu. We went to uh, training ground. Practice, Practice training. So if I went over the gal, there he is. Oh, wait, he didn't get no mustache there. Pink hair. That's that classic down, what was this, um, super color. Was that championship edition right there? That's badass looking. That's fucking looking amazing. 
No, there's Championship Edition number two. So I went to Chung Li. Went up to the costume. There it is. Oh god, it's shiny as fuck. There it is. I want to say, I knew that there was a blonde Chung Li in this damn game. It's number nine. Some of them, well, nearly all of them, I like the newer variations because it's just uh, it's just time for new shit, you know. Now, most of them are wearing more clothes. I ain't particularly concerned about that. Um, my known would be a fucking badass because I know her damn alternate looks freaking insane. All right, so I'm gonna call it right here. I might eventually do some of the rest of these costumes on my own eventually. Now, um, I don't know if I'm gonna buy the characters. Eventually, there's gonna be like a super duper, like you know, uber du duper edition that will have all that shit in it. I might just wait to then and then get that and then come back and I might do their um, do some more Master World Tour shit. Uh, at a much later date. We're talking about a couple years down the line. But, um... Dude, I love this fucking game. This game's great. This is uh, the best Street Fighter's been since Street Fighter 2. In my opinion. At least it's from a launch date. Uh, and this is like... A fucking phenomenal. This is up and down great. Um, re redemption. That's what it is. It's redemption. Because I was so bitter and... About the way Street Fighter 5 launched. My, my friend, my podcast bro, he bought a damn PlayStation 4 for that shit. And then, um, we're trying to go, it's, it's done launch, we're about ready to play, and we can't even do fucking lobbies. We can't do fucking lobbies because they didn't exist at the time. You could only do, um, rank and then rando, um, unranked against randos. And I'm like, this is, this is freaking, this is how y'all started the game. This is bullshit. But, um, they went out of their way on Street Fighter 6, and it, it was good. It's fucking good as shit. 